how's it going people? It is the Hawk here and today I am gonna go and ask the Echo Dot some questions and just go over some features and different things that the Echo Dot may do that you may not be aware of and just some fun things the Echo Dot can do that even Siri can't even do. So first thing you know if you have one, if you don't have one, there's some commands. The most notable command is, first of all, put it on mute when I do this, is saying Alexa. That's the default. Then you can call it Echo if you change the setting, or you can call it Amazon. But now, because they have the new technology of only the closest Echo Dot or Echo Listening, you can say Alexa without all of them chiming in, so you really have no need to change it unless it's personal preference. So for me, I kept it with Alexa. So let's go on and ask some questions. So let's start with Alexa. Who are you going to vote for? If I could vote, I'd vote for BB-8. I like the way he rolls. <laughs> Alexa, roll a dice. I rolled a die and got one. Alexa, roll two dice. I rolled two dice and got three and five for a total of eight. Alexa, roll six dice. I rolled six dice and got two, three, four, one, two, and two for a total of fourteen. Alexa, roll ten dice. I rolled ten dice and got one, one, six, three, five, six, six. Two, one, and six for a total of thirty-seven. Alexa, roll fifty dice. I rolled fifty dice and got six. Alexa, three, stop. Three, four, four. Alexa, four, three, stop. Two. So it's interesting, as you can see, I fifty dice, and it was going to continue, so I stopped it. I don't know what the magical number is for it to roll dice, and you tell it. A certain number and it won't roll because it's too high of a number, but it does up to 50 so far. Alexa, play paper, rock, scissors. Okay, let's play. Three, two, one, rock. Oh, beat me. Pretty cool. Uh, let's see. I have in the background my Phillips you like. So I know this works with Philips Hue, and to me it's much faster. So I set this one up as bedroom because it's the one that normally stays in my master bedroom. I just swapped it out here for video use. So Alexa, turn on bedroom. Okay. And as you've seen, bedroom went on. Alexa, turn bedroom to 10%. Okay. Alexa, turn bedroom to 100%. Okay. Alexa, turn bedroom to green. Please try again with the device name and setting. You see, Alexa does not understand the color. So when you tell it to do whatever with the color, it doesn't understand it. It understands scenes, but not colors. But if I was to go ahead and use Siri, and I tell Siri, Siri, turn bedroom to green. Sorry, I didn't hear back. First of all, it tells me it didn't hear back, so let me register, make sure it's on the correct Wi-Fi, which is an issue if it's, nope, it's on the correct Wi-Fi, so. As you've seen, it's telling me it's on my correct Wi-Fi that I have set up, but it's telling me it did not hear back. Turn bedroom to green. green. And there it goes. Turn bedroom to arm. Turn bedroom off.
So, pretty good. Say Alexa's a little faster. Let's try the watch. Hey Siri, turn bedroom to green. Hey Siri, turn bedroom off. Okay, so in the aspect of which one faster, they both are pretty fast this time. Before I had some issues, as you see, the first time I went with Siri on the iPhone, it didn't do it. Every other time it did it, it was pretty fast. Now, when I tried the Echo Dot, the Echo Dot ended up telling me that yes, it can do it, except for when I asked for the color. Couldn't do the color. Now, this has a bunch of microphones on it, always listening. Phone doesn't always listen unless you have it plugged in. The watch will always listen, but then the watch has to connect to the phone for the Wi-Fi, and that becomes the issue there. But when dealing with all this, pretty decent. Now, I can ask Siri, let's see. Siri, play. Pandora top hits. Play Pandora. Okay, so Siri opened up Pandora and I said play Pandora, but it didn't actually want to play Pandora top hit. Now that can be an issue for some people, may not be an issue for some people. But if I say, hey, Alexa, play Pandora's top 80 top hit. Getting your pop station from Pandora, 80s pop radio. Alexa, stop. And as you've seen, it started playing. It was Journey. Pretty good. If I tell it to, let's see. So Siri won't be able to do this. I've already tried it. And if you don't believe me, you can try it yourself. But if I tell Alexa, play Q102 iHeartRadio, which is my station from Philadelphia. Q102 on iHeartRadio. Alexa, stop. And there it went to play my station from back in Philadelphia area. So that is pretty cool in my honest opinion. And there are many more features. Like if you go out and you get the Harmony Hub, you'll be able to tell it to go ahead and turn on different devices in your house that are like your TV your gaming system, your home theater system, basically anything that can be controlled by the Harmony Universal Remote, you're going to be able to control with this. Now, mine is hooked up to my Bluetooth right now, so I enjoy it, and I like where I can just free roam in the house when I wake up in the morning, and I'm getting ready for work, or I'm eating or whatever, I can go ahead and tell it to play some kind of music off of what I want to hear at the time, and it just automatically does it. I can... Let's try this. I will show you what the difference is between the jokes of the two. Tell me a joke. I can't. I always forget the punchline. Tell me a joke. Matt, get serious. <laughs> Tell me a joke. I don't think you'd understand a joke in my language. They're not so funny, anyway. Tell me a joke. Let me think. Nope, can't think of one. What's the meaning of life? To think about questions like this. What is zero divided by zero? Imagine that you have zero cookies and you split them evenly among zero friends. How many cookies does each person get? See, it doesn't make sense. And Cookie Monster is sad that there are no cookies. 
and you are sad that you have no friends. So to me, that was an interesting joke. Now, let's ask the Amazon Echo, because I think those some of those jokes weren't all that great. Now, the zero divided by zero is pretty cool. That's an interesting way to say that it just doesn't work. Alexa, tell me a joke. Why can't you trust Adam? <coughs> because they make up everything. Alexa, tell me a joke. Music is coming out of the printer. I think the paper's jamming again. <laughs> Alexa, tell me a joke. A snake walks into a bar. The bartender says, how'd you do that? Alexa, tell me a joke. Alexa, tell me a joke. What is black and white and red all over? A skunk with a rat. Alexa, tell me a joke. What's brown and sticky? A stick. Alexa, tell me a joke. Why was the broom late? It overswept. So as you see, if I can continue this, Alexa has many more jokes to tell. And another thing that's great about Alexa, let's see. If I ask Siri, Siri, what's the bounty bowl? I found a few hotels matching bounty. What is the Sorry, bounty bowl? What is the bounty bowl? Okay, check. What is the bounty bowl? Okay, check it out. So it really didn't understand it, and it went straight into Wikipedia. So let's see if the Echo Dot can do much better. Now, I did it before, so I'm hoping it should clearly understand it. Alexa, what is the Bounty Bowl? The Bounty Bowl was the name given to two NFL games held in 1989 between the Philadelphia Eagles and Dallas Cowboys. Alexa, what is the Body Bag Game? The body bag game was a Monday night football game that was played on November 12, 1990, between the Philadelphia Eagles and Washington Redskins at Veterans Stadium. So as you've seen, I personally think this is a much better system than what Siri is and what Siri can do now. Granted, Siri has some capabilities that the Amazon Echo does not have yet, but they're always going to be upgrading this as they are always trying to upgrade Siri. But to me, this just does a better job. They took what Siri can do and they made it better. But you can judge this video and make your own opinion on it. But as of right now, I use this way more than I use Siri right now. So that's where I'm going to conclude this video. And if you'd like to see more, you have any comments, or you want me to do anything else with it, please comment below. And as always, hit that subscribe button, and don't forget to like this video so I can continue to make more videos for you. Thank you for watching.